Well, good morning. Here we are in Santa Ana, California, here at this Shinoda Design Center. This is a really, well, it's a real fun place. It's kind of, kind of like a candy store for decorators. It has just everything. Uh, and today is, uh, you know, glass, well, for instance, they have glassware and ribbons and knickknacks and this and that stuff for just you know, planning parties, for florists, everything. It's a humongous ass building. Today is their Christmas launch of all their Christmas stuff and all their finery. So we're going to go check it out. There's, ordinarily, they're not open on Sunday anymore, but the parking lot's full of cars. So it'll all be interesting. So we're going to go on there and we'll, we'll take a look at what's going on, okay? Okay, ready to be amazed here? Yeah? You need little figurines, things to put in your living room. Wow. And then on the end cap of every one of these aisles has some kind of vignette where these items are that they sell. And they kind of do it by color. See? Look at this. Wow. I guess this would be the Barbie tree. Everything pink. But it's really clever, the people that work here who assemble all of this stuff. Imagine you get all of this stuff in boxes and you have to put it together. You know, to display all this, the like things. Okay, now this is kind of like a nice, elegant one. Look at that, is that a bridge? Look at, you're a mean one. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. Okay, so anyway. You got your black and silver and white. These are really beautiful, look at those. And then below they'll have the things here that you need that are on that set. Here's another one. This is really modern. Hmm. I usually try to, we have a game here where we, where we do that. We look at every one of these vignettes and then we have to pick the one that we like the best. There's the uh, patriotic one. Actually, since it is September 10th, for me at least, September 1st is the unofficial start of the holiday season for me. And I look at it this way, that uh, really it's uh, the Halloween, Thanksgiving, Christmas, and New Year's. They're all the same. It's all one big party. So I don't care about people having decorations overlapping. It's all the same. Okay, so here's all your flower arranging things. Look at that. You wanna make something fabulous? Look at all this. Pots and glass things. Just amazes me. You know, from funerals and things. Now here, here's what you see as a traditional Christmas. If that's true, this one is really beautiful. Look at that, with all the twinkly lights. Yeah, that's, that's classic. I love that. I guess Carlos got the same idea here. See a lot of gold and silver on these. One. Okay, now this one's, you know what this one is? Here we go. But we're going to Disneyland now. And uh, this is basically, it's a small world. All that pastel, that is so beautiful cake with frosting and stuff. Wow. Whoever designed that did a beautiful job. Now see, they have to pull all this together, all these ribbons. This little, uh, like, freaky elf thing. That is really cool. 
and then wrap all these up with this fabric and this ribbon and then the right lighting okay I'm impressed now this one here this one here basically excites me because it's got your fall colors you've got Christmas it's very countryish it's almost a, as if it was in a cabin look at this this wiry stuff I like these moths you got a square wheel on there. <laughs> yeah, that one was cool. Okay, so we're going to walk down here. Um, I actually want to go to the area where they have fall things, where you, know, you have ceramic pumpkins and turkeys and all that stuff. So we'll see. Now, here we've got a little uh, nativity set. Different ones. We have one similar like that. Got it at Walmart. Okay, so they've got a Halloween one. This really wax? Yeah. Okay, so where did they go? There they are. Okay, here we are. We're, we're in the area with the fall things, which I really get excited over. We ha you know, we have so many pumpkins and stuff already, so it's kind of hard to find things that we don't have. We have some of that stuff. You know, little, let's see, what is this? See, let's see, now that's like a little, just a little thing. So that's $5.95 with 40% off. So that's really cheap, like $3 or something. I, not, this is the kind of things I like. We have a bunch of those. Those have been, been sold forever. Those are really cheap too, like $3. Leaves. Okay, this is kind of cute. And little centerpiece things. Okay, they're having some kind of show go on. Design area. Oh. Okay, I don't remember this. Let's go see. See if you're gonna have a party or a gathering. See how clever you get ideas like this. They do this at weddings. Okay, so he's basically doing a demonstration on the ribbon and how to make things. So, you know, they don't care about the price of golf balls and cigars, but this kind of, oh, we don't need that. So, what I like to do is in the back, this is just wire. I'll do it for you right now. Let's make it. Uh, I get like two pieces right here. You see one right over here, like the right there. And they're putting out all the Costco yeah. stuff. So, is this this wall for me? Okay, we'll walk back. You know, over here they used to have like florists or something and they've taken over. Can you imagine all of these boxes are full of the finest of Chinese things? Okay, so more and more and more and more. 
Okay, so. All right, all more fall stuff. We're kind of in the market today to get some kind of things to put on the porch. We have these on the wall of our house, a couple of clay terracotta type plantery things. So we want to put something fall like in there. Okay, we're going to have an avalanche. <laughs> a fall avalanche. I think they did that on purpose. Oh, and look, that would have been a disaster if I would have dropped that glass. This, this needs to be fixed. I'm going to put it up here out of the way. Okay. All right. I better not touch anything else. Break it, you take it, remember? Okay, so then, oh, right, I love this too. This is, this is right up my alley. I see, I get excited when I see the fall things. You know, the way the weather changes and then you start seeing everything orange and pumpkin-y. I just love that. Some more stuff here. Fake fruit. Now those are pretty good for being imitation looking. Yeah. Okay. Okay, are you looking for any kind of ribbon? Well, you're in, you're in the market here for ribbon, you're gonna find it. Then you got this kind of stuff too, little bags that you uh, put stuff in and tie with a tie thing. All different sizes. Okay. This is just mind blowing. And then it goes away up and then they poke little things out the side to let you know what's in those things, in those boxes. See? All I can say is I wouldn't want to be in here in an earthquake. Now see, let's say you want to make a thing. You're going to do a party or a wedding or something. You're the designer. You come in for this kind of stuff. And create your fabulous whatever it is. Wow. Okay, what is this? Just some kind of fabric. That's all it is, burlapy things. Then over here they usually have all clearance things. I don't know, yeah. Really bargain galore here. I bought stuff here before. This is all things. Now see, that's kind of fall-like, but not very cool. But you can get really super deals on this discontinued kind of thing. Usually in the front. All of this. Okay, well, another row of ribbon. We bought some really beautiful Christmas and fall ribbon here that they have really nice designs in them. And the, the, the kind with the wire in it that you can bend around. Let's see, nothing's jumping out at me right away. Hmm. They probably have it at those vignettes, all of that stuff gathered up, because this is just your average kind of stuff. Oh, here, they're blocking it all. That's the Christmas stuff. See? Okay. Oh yeah, here more. Here's more red. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm looking for the orange things. Okay, now see, look, Valentine's. Valentine's Day. All kinds of neat little deals. Okay. I'm just, uh, just kind of back here, randomly. More Christmas stuff. Oh my goodness. Now I'm going to sneak back here because now you got Christmas ornaments. Balls. Bulbs or whatever they call those.
Now back here they have trees. Christmas trees. Now those are gigantic. How much, for instance, would something like this cost? All right. That's $200 right there. This big old Santa. Mm. I don't see the price on him. Wow. Okay, this could be yours for $1,369. This one too, look at how gigantic that one. $1,600 for those. Those are really cool. Basically Disneyland things. Now, okay, as I was saying, back here they have uh, Christmas trees usually all set up. Man, you gotta have a big tree for that. Okay. Well, all right, we're having a traffic jam. Okay, so we're in the middle here. All right. Not all of them light up, though. Okay, so here they are. Oh, wait, here. Okay, look. You know, that was the most amazing in invention to have a Christmas tree with the lights all already built in. Personally, I just kind of look, I like just the steady. But see, these are old fashioned. These are those ones that they're all going different with LED. Now, these are the old ones, you know, that you put in. They can pull out and you can change them. Those other ones. The LED ones where they're kind of like a little round. Yeah, kind of like this. See, they're little short things. And then you can make them do stuff and change color. I personally just, I'm a fan of that. Just the little small ones. And if they do twinkle, that's an absolute no. What it has to do is individually twinkle. Now that's really cool. Looks like uh, you just drug it in from outside. This one's neat, but the big, you could hang a lot of neat ornaments on this one because of the separation. Okay, for instance, this tree here, eight fifty nine ninety. Oh, wow, look at this one. I like that. Pretty cool. wow. Okay. All right, let's, let's look over here. You know, you want potted plants that are fake. All of this kind of branch type reef things that you use to make things, you know, where you tie things on them. Yeah. See, people create centerpieces and things with stuff like that. This is a really unique place. You can't, it's almost like the Grand Canyon. You have to see it with your own eyes. You can't really, even this video of showing you these things, you gotta come in here on your own. You need a basket? You'll find it here. Okay, what do we have? Just a little, uh, you put photos in those little things, I guess, with a cupcake. You know, they slide the pictures or whatever else you want in there. This and that. Glass covered stuff. Let's, let's go around here. More baskets. Endless. Okay, I'm gonna cut through here. There's mirrored things in here. Look at this. This is actually really pretty. Glued on stones. Twenty nine fifty. Yeah. What are these? These are stickers. Okay. Little jewels that these little things peel off individually. That you can put them on stuff. Similar to this. Okay. More of that. Is this macrame? Yeah. I remember in the 70s when I was in junior high, macrame was really the thing. And uh, I remember making a macrame pot holder. I don't know what 
whatever happened to that. Okay. All right, I'm going to see where my uh, group is and go find them. Okay, you got your Halloween things here. That's a real popular holiday. Supposedly that follows Christmas. That's how popular that, that's gotten now for decorating. So everybody's all kind of congregating in this aisle. Now this is a pretty one. This is all Mardi Gras kind of styled. Purple sure is a nice color. Okay, where'd they go? I saw them up here. Oh, there they are. See, he's, he's already got the fall stuff. Okay. Okay, so you know what? I did a real quickie thing, unless I see anything else. But you see, uh, if you're ever in Santa Ana, California, and you, I guess you have to have a business license to actually come in here and shop. So, or if you know somebody who has a business, you just register your business license in here, and then you can come in here and buy things. So, if you're ever in Santa, Santa Ana, California, uh, you know, this this is the place you want to come to for decorating. I still, that one really, although I wouldn't have it in my house, I just find those colors so beautiful. With those lights. Wow. Okay, so, this is it, Shinoda Design Center in uh, Santa Ana, California. Off of Dyer Road. And, um, what's the other one? Flower? It's around there. This is the place you gotta come. Okay. Hope you enjoyed the little tour. Just a little taste of it. So, bye for now.